What makes you insecure? Why? When someone is watching me do something. I feel like I should have accomplished more at my age. I'm afraid to choose the music when there are other people around. I always feel like people will judge me on my musical choices. Despite the countless number of applications, virtual interviews have been on. I've been unemployed since the start of quarantine. Pretty much everything. My memory seems to be very unreliable for the last few years. And I have an awful lot of brain fog. I have to keep loads of notes and alarms in order to function. I'm also increasingly depressed and neurotic. Which cancels out any remaining charm my personality used to have. It's humiliating. And I'm very insecure about it. And it's getting worse. I can't hear well. I have an impossible time distinguishing what one person is saying from surrounding sounds. I'm not deaf. I'm just hard of hearing in a way that means asking people to repeat themselves to the point of them being exasperated with me. Pretty humiliating. I'm also injured in a way that interferes with my gait. I can't walk anywhere without feeling mortified by how I look. Plus I'm poor. Short. Bald. Etc. Meanwhile. My wife and my girlfriend are perfect tens. In my view. At least. And I'm pretty insecure about losing those relationships as I continue to physically and mentally fray. It's bleak. There's just so much. You know. Edit. I appreciate all the advice. Awards. And kind comments. I'll look into as much of it as I can. Less than perfect teeth. 2020 masks are a positive thing for me. Whenever I realize that the perception I have of myself is very different than the way people actually see me. It makes me feel like a very different person. My height. I'm a 5, 2 man. Being 27 years old and never having a girlfriend. Edit. Thanks everyone for all the feedback. Really appreciate it. Made me feel better. Making phone calls. I know I am bad at explaining things. It's something I am working on. But when talking on the phone. I can't see your face to see if you are understanding what I am saying. I don't have any visual cues for if you agree or disagree with what I am saying. I find it very stressful. That I don't have a drive to be the best I'm always content wherever I am. I often wonder where my life would be if I put in 100% in every area in life. Probably a lot farther than I am now. Looks. Weight. Smarts. Lack of skills. Social abilities. Athleticism. And basically everything except being good at trumpet. My mom comparing me with other people. Since I feel like I'm not good enough for her. I'm not a very interesting person. Like I'm just average at everything. No natural talents. No funny stories to tell. No particular personality really. My weight. Just cause I feel unhealthy and gross and hate the way it looks. But I am trying my best to fix that. Already lost 20 pounds. D. I don't have any insecurities so don't bring it up again. Okay. My teeth. They fugly. My stammer. I hate when I know something. When I have an answer ready or I'm trying to say something. And I physically just can't get it out. People assume that I'm unprepared or dumb and try to finish my sentences. My boyfriend will leave me cause I can't have children. I am 32 and he is 27. We have discussed it in big detail and he says he is perfectly fine never being a dad but I still worry. My now ex-husband and I divorced because after he turned 30 he wanted suddenly want children. Edit. Thank you all for the comments and the award. I didn't think this would get that much attention. A little more detail. I am child free by choice. I had my tubes tied in my 20s and ex knew that the whole 10 years we were together. I never hid it from him and he always assure me he was on board with it. But he turned 30 was starting to hint at it but I told him it won't ever happen because I have no desire to be a mother. My boyfriend's knows about my insecurity and understands my fear and I love him so much for it. We'll have to see what the future has for us. Also to the. Ending my bloodline. Comment. I have four other siblings who have children. I think the bloodline will be okay. How much time you got? My dad yelling at me. I'm 40. Being alone at the age of 29 with no real social life to speak of. Being a virgin. I know it shouldn't but it does. My nose. It's the biggest nose I've ever seen on anyone. I've seen hundreds of thousands of people in my life in real life and in video or photos and I've never seen anyone with a bigger nose than me. Some people have noses that are as big but not bigger.
It's also greasy and filled with disgusting blackheads in every single pore. It's been this way since I was in the 7th grade. I'm a 30-year-old male virgin. I quite possibly have the most disgusting nose on earth. No. This isn't a joke either. I'm severely depressed and border on being suicidal from month to month. When someone I don't know well asks me for my unvarnished, honest opinion on something, not knowing how they'll likely react and how far to go makes me feel uncomfortable responding. Big life changes. When I started high school I almost had a breakdown. I don't know why but I was extremely anxious about moving on. Of course turns out I worried for no reason. But I'm afraid how I'll react when one day I have to go away for college. I'm an introvert because when I'm talking to people I feel like I'm annoying them. I feel like I should have had a relationship by now. The idea that maybe I'm headed in the wrong direction in my life right now and don't even know it. I hate that I'm losing my hair before 30. Baldness does not agree with me. My thighs I have hip dips and no ass so when I wear jeans they always pudge out in an unattractive way and I can't wear shoes or legging cause they look really fat and pudgy. My average to below average penis size. Imposter syndrome. A wise man once said that. I know that I know nothing. I'm kinda sick and was sleeping and woke up because I shit myself in my sleep. So. I'm insecure about posting on Reddit because I usually think my comment is not well thought out enough and I will get downvoted into oblivion. I'm ugly. The knowledge that all my best friends, people I consider to truly be a part of me, will eventually move on and I'll be another memory they may think of fondly from time to time. I hate it. My dog is more hung than me. How I'm perceived by other people when at a public place. My nipples, they look like pepperoni. I was born with severe erectile dysfunction and can only get erections if I use an IM medication directly into the shaft. IDK how I'm supposed to meet a girl and get to the point where I feel like she's comfortable with me without finding out on her own too early and scaring her away. I'm afraid to choose the music when there are other people around. I always feel like people will judge me on my musical choices. When someone is watching me do something, pictures of me. I don't like how I look. I never take selfies. Never posted a picture of myself on social media. Hate getting my pictures taken. I always avoid group photos. Despite the countless number of applications, virtual interviews have been on. I've been unemployed since the start of quarantine. I feel like I should have accomplished more at my age. 